Ivanka Trump shows off her flat stomach in a pastel purple outfit. After sharing an old baby bump photo with followers as part of a gushing tribute to Jared on his 37th birthday, Ivanka Trump is ready for spring, and is already modeling pastel colors and floral details in preparation for the warmer season. The first daughter, 36, was seen this morning leaving her house in Washington, D.C., wearing light hues from a pale pastel purple to a bright white. She donned a $695 Altuzer crude neck sweater with belt sleeves and a flower embarrassment, paired with a pencil skirt tied at her waist with a belt. Ivanka finished off her outfit with olive green pumps and a white coat, which she carried on her arm while walking from her house to her parked Secret Service car. She wore her long hair down in a blowout, letting her eye-catching earrings peek out from under her blonde locks. Gerald Kushner, who turned 37 today, was also seen leaving about 15 minutes before his wife and fellow White House advisor. Sticking to his classics, he stepped out in a suit and tie and smiled as he walked to the Secret Service vehicle waiting for him. A little later this morning, Ivanka took to Instagram to wish her husband of the years a happy birthday, along with a gushing tribute to him. Happy birthday, Jared. Thank you for being the most amazing father, husband, and best friend I could have dreamed of. Here's to you. Ivanka wrote. She chose to post her message next to a throwback picture of herself with Jared, back when she was pregnant with one of their three children. Ivanka can be seen in the photo, dressed in a pale pink sundress, cradling her baby bump and resting her hand on Jared's shoulder. The first daughter originally shared the snap in January 2016, when she was pregnant with her and Jared's third child, Theodore, now one. Her decision to share the image now, however, confused some of her followers, who thought she was announcing the fourth pregnancy and even congratulated her. Ivanka cut the more wintry silhouette on Sunday when she stepped out with her three children, all bundled up to fend off the cold deep sea weather. The mother was first seen arriving home with son Joseph, or, who was wearing a Paddington Bear-style coat. Later in the day, she emerged from the house with Joseph and her other two kids, one-year-old Theodore and Arabella, six. Ivanka looked ready for the weather in a double-breasted navy coat, jeans and black boots. Along with Joseph in his stylish blue jacket, Ivanka's other two children sported stylish little parkas and hats, with one-year-old Theodore's sweet pom-pom beanie hat also including a set of attached mittens. Ivanka appeared happy and carefree despite her husband Jared Kushner's real estate company coming under investigation by the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission for its use of a federal program that grants visas to wealthy foreigners investing in the United States. The news, reported by the Wall Street Journal on Sunday, sees Kushner cause asked by the SEC for information on its use of a visa program known as EB-5 in May 2017, according to a person the journal said was familiar with the matter. The EB-5 visa is a method for eligible immigrants to become lawful permanent residents, or green card holders by investing at least $500,000 into a business in the United States that will employ 10 or more American workers. Most holders are wealthy Chinese individuals. The journal said the company also received a separate request from New York federal prosecutors in the same month for information on development projects financed in part by the EB-5 program. The latest revelation involving Kushner's firm came after Michael Wolff claimed in his new book, Fire and Fury that Trump was considering his son-in-law as Secretary of State. The book depicts Ivanka and Kushner as virtually at war with Steve Bannon inside a tumultuous White House. Ivanka herself was also the subject of shock revelations this weekend as it was revealed that her contact with a Russian attorney and a lobbyist in 2016 has attracted the attention of special counsel Robert Mueller's investigation. The president's daughter reportedly came into contact with Russian lawyer, Natalia Veselnutskaya, and the lobbyist. Renak Dokmitchin, while they were exiting the building during a brief elevator ride. A person familiar with the encounter told the Los Angeles Times that while the exchange consisted of pleasantries, investigators want to know every interaction Trump's family members and inner circle had with them. The report also says that one participant in the meeting with the Kremlin-connected attorney has been recalled for questioning. It is believed that Mueller's focus specifically on President Trump's misleading claim that the meeting had to do with Russian adoption, and not with the goal of obtaining damaging information on Hillary Clinton, could indicate that investigators are looking at obstruction of justice by the President and several close advisors. 
as opposed to collusion with the Russians. The meeting, during the height of the presidential race, was between his eldest son, Donald Trump Jr., his son-in-law, Gerald Kushner, and his campaign manager, Paul Manafort, along with Veselnitskaya and Opmichin.